before. He sold the car long before the. Yes, yeah, it was before. He sold before. Before the Dubai. Yes. It's a pleasure, sir. Okay. I don't carry my sister. See, if you do me, I do you. We thank God. Whatsoever you have done is perfect. I want to trust you that this purpose today, why we have come to meet together, will be established, will be fulfilled in the name of Jesus. Amen. I want to thank you for the life of Franklin and his fiancée, that as they continue this journey, it will be full of peace, it will be full of harmony, it will be full of joy. In the name of Jesus. Amen. He has no reason to regret coming to this family. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And I stand in the authority of the word of God tonight to decree and to declare that no weapon fashioned, programmed, organized, orchestrated from the pit of hell, from the kingdom of darkness, against this union shall prosper in the name of Jesus. Amen. Bible speaking, there are many devices in the heart of men but it is only the counsel of the Lord that shall stand. I stand in this existing word of God that it is only the word of God and the counsel of the God Almighty that shall be established in your marriage. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. I stand upon my testimony. I went to Imo State. I came back peacefully. I have my children. My wife is with me peacefully. So shall your own be. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You will not bring your parents, your family to this family and have any cause to regret. You have any cause for reproach. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Any power that we contend for this marriage today. I take authority in the name of Jesus to frustrate that power. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The mother of your wife never know what is called broken home. You never know what is called separation. You never know what is called divorce. You will never experience divorce. Amen. I speak and I prophetically speak over your life and destiny that from this moment, your life will be transformed to the glory of God and to the shame of the devil and the enemies in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father, because I know whenever we call upon you, there are three or four of us are together in your name, you are always there. Thank you for hearing this prayer. As we continue, we demand that you continue with us, be with us in the name of Jesus. Amen. They come here in peace, they shall return to their various home in peace. Amen. There shall be no accident, there shall be no attack on the highway, there shall be no evil negative news concerning this meeting tonight. In Jesus' name. Amen. Jesus Christ's name we have prayed. Amen. I soak this prayer with the blood of Jesus. Amen. And whatever we shall eat, whatever we shall drink, whatever we shall partake on here tonight, they shall live here. It's sanctified with the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Father, for hearing us. Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Listen, my brother is here. Also, we would like to know his mother. Then uh, they also introduce themselves to you. So as they are breaking the cola before we just partake in the cola, we just briefly do that introduction. Thank you, Good evening, everyone. Good evening, sir. My name is Nze. I go in Zerim Godwin. This is my first son, Franklin. Zerim. This is my Franklin, see now this one. And my son too. Look, I introduce everybody. We have seen them already. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Welcome, sir. So we thank God for today. And uh, 
great to God that all things we are going to do today will be joined. My name is Daniel Ono. I'm the father of this compound. Okay. And I'm the father of the daughter that are coming here to marry. Okay. I've been speaking, isn't it? Yeah. So you ought to know my name. My name is Achanya Francis, Mr. Achanya Francis. Okay, the next son of this family. And I'm training this family in this house, Mr. Wapa. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah, oh, let him know it. 
uh, where the document? Uh, okay. <laughs> 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 you are the <laughs> <laughs> You never know what Indian class is. <laughs> Frankly. <laughs> so, we want to follow that process. He is there with us. I personally have it. He has it also. That's why I went to pick my yes. So that all of us will be on the same page. Um, so let those things that are needed, that are supposed to be here, be very close to the mm. and coming from mm. the community. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So, yes, sir. I'm not there, and ちょっと、<笑><笑> ela <laughs> Rather <laughs> said, you know, I don't want to eat and vomit back. If you are not sure of what you are doing, talk now. She said, I love Franklin. Okay. And that was why the father accepted the cola. But above that, sir, Franklin also should not do anything bad, wrong to our sister and our daughters also. Give me that over, sir. This one, Gandhi, the mother.
kama uchemalo mane kaumani la kaumani la habisi so dibuka
1,500 million naira. Brother Moses, you know Moses, the one that pointed that water, yeah. and the water parted, yeah. and the children of Israel passed. Yeah. And when they fished and pursued him, they were dry inside the water. His own is one million too. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Mama. Yeah. Five million naira. Yeah. Oxygen. Yeah. This is daddy's sister. She wants to give her own children, daughters, for marriage. One million naira. You know, David, that he go lie at. I used to go lie at Cutlass and cut his head. Two million naira. That is the younger brother to our in law. I have to drop my phone and come this morning. You know, when you know, be fine. If you know Puchuku, never pronounce the name. Wow. One million, two million, three million, four million, five million, six million. If I Chuku. He's still coming. No? I say this, my sister is too beautiful. Uh -huh. Hey, our mommy, you are welcome, ma. You will be having plenty of daughters. I will come again to marry from Imo State. <laughs> One million naira. If you like life, now you can't just love your if wife. If you like, you don't know, go back on that person. I go go. You don't know, go anywhere. I go go. I don't tell you. I don't tell you. Ungozi, 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 ungozi. Make a support, Lord. Because my wife will be We don't know the of Lolo. Ask us. We don't know. Yes. Ask us. will tell you. What the Tell us. Lolo, one million naira. Hey, 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 hey. Uncle, this guy has been smiling. Frankly, be careful with this guy. He has been smiling. I was just smiling. He's a good friend. Or oh, a good brother. You are happy for him. My brother. Five. No. You can see me too bad. What is it, sir? Five. If I need to go again, I don't tell you. I think I say it. If I need to go, one million. Two million. Three million. Four million. If I need to go square. That is immediately on the ground. Don't you one million? Emeka, You know, if you go to you don't put Emeka. You don't go complete. Chuku Emeka, five million. Hey, do it now, Hey, one million naira. Are we together? Auntie? I hope our brothers are here. We 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 all of that is we are doing since. This is the joy of the marriage. A place where there is marriage and there is no joy. That marriage is not fully celebrated. I'm happy that all of us supported our daughter and Mr. Franklin. God bless you, sir. You are welcome, sir. Uh, if you see our time is uh, going, and uh, we have less than one or two things to do now, and we just uh, pray together. But if you are here, 
The way you are happy, laughing, celebrating with these two young folk that will be crowned tomorrow with you. They will clap for them like this. So let me hear you. About celebrating my children, 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 my children
like you don't even know Your body is so fine Melanin for the widow Your smile is messy with my mind Just call my phone, make it ring Let me just look at your face, oh baby I'll never forget this now May you just come to my place, oh baby I might never let you out Your sister driving me so, so crazy Almost he gets me, oh Almost he gets me, oh Baby, you're a 10 over 10, 10 Now it's it on the tail of my friends I, I brag about you, ain't no sin, though I don't say
Be attentive to our prayers, O Lord, and your kindness of both worlds you have established for the increase of human race, so that the union you have created may be kept safe by your assistance. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, the Son, who lives and reigns with you in the image of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. On do a white oma oka. O chica caught on your oh for funu. A man gave your channel, O Taboma, who gave your law. O you got a loma, O we part Gemma, on do a white oma, O Apa Jebe, Yai Pachia. Memory Jaja, I bano, and eh, we go over Lopo Waito. Ipeje ejo la ni loya lo homa oku bige lo chonyo homa oke le diye oke siwa le fonyo nyama jeluwa onyo nyawa eko riye egane oke jie manu amadu o chonyo homa anuma ogra ki anla o iye je la ebe ine loke li pene du membra agbano ene lo yo po wa echo membra e bedudu ene lo ke bi pa ti du papa lo ke wo tabo yo to ni roma lo ke ke ni nu en o ndu ene lo wa echo ma o wa lo cho ni roma ma ya o ya che ka ma ko bo ogbiola ikuriku e kene lo ke bo ogbiola ma ne o wa po ike Because of God's grace, mercy to us, I appeal to you. Offer yourselves as a living sacrifice to God, dedicated to His service and pleasing to Him. This is the true worship that you should offer. 
Do not conform yourselves to the standards of this world, but let God transform you inwardly by a complete change of your mind. Then you'll be able to know the will of God, what is good and is pleasing to Him and is perfect. Love must be completely sincere. Hate what is evil, hold on to what is good. Love one another warmly as Christians, brothers and sisters, but for one another. Work hard and do not be lazy. Serve the Lord with a heart full of devotion. Let your hope keep you joyful. Pray at all times. Share your belongings with your needy fellow Christians. And open your homes to strangers. The word of the Lord. Some Pharisees approached Jesus and asked him, Is it against the law for a man to divorce his wife? They were testing him. He answered them, What did Moses command you? Moses allowed us, they said, to draw up a rate of dismissal. So to divorce, then Jesus said to them, It was because you were so unteachable that he wrote his commandment for you. But from the beginning of creation, God made them male and female. This is why a man must leave father and mother and the two become one body. They are no longer two, therefore, but one body. So then, what God has united, man must not divide. Back in the house, the disciples questioned him again about this, and he said to them, the man who divorces his wife and marries another is guilty of adultery against her. And if a woman divorces her husband and marries another, she is guilty of adultery too. People were bringing little children to him for him to touch them. The disciples taught them away, but Jesus saw this. He was indignant and said to them, Let the little children come to me. Do not stop them, for it is to such as come as these that the kingdom of God belongs. I tell you solemnly, anyone who does not welcome the kingdom of God like a little child 
who never eat her eat. Then he put his arms around them, laid his hands on them, and gave them his blessing. Jesus. Eighteen years ago, I was ordained a priest, and as a very, very young priest, I was posted to St. Edward's Parish, Oupa here. When I arrived here 18 years ago, I had this very small friend whose father was a church leader of one of our stations. And almost on a weekly or daily basis, this little friend of mine will take her part and tell the parents she was going to visit her reverend father. And then she will leave the house station and come to the father's house in St. Edward's Parish here. Whenever she came to the father's house, she spoke only two things from the time she came until when she was leaving to go back to her father's house in the evening. That, my friend, was a very, very shy person. She would not look at her reverend father in the face. She would just come and sit down, and then as soon as she comes, it was good afternoon, father, or good evening, father, as the case may be. And that was the last thing. The next thing you are going to hear was goodbye, Father. I am going. Sometimes she could spend up to two hours, sometimes more than two hours, at other times less than two hours. But for each time she came, she had only two things to say. Good afternoon, Father, and goodbye, Father. Today, this very little friend of mine who will leave Adu in Oupa to come to Ayodu in Oupa to come and see her reverend father has become the bride that all of us have come to celebrate here. 18 years, I am coming back here now to participate in the wedding ceremony of that my very shy friend who will tell me just two things, good afternoon father and goodbye father. Today I came in here and I simply told her I have also come to hands my hands off you and I told her good morning. The next thing I will tell her is goodbye to your husband's house. And we are gathered here today. Whatever God wants to make to happen in the life of anybody, God prearranges it according to his own arrangement from the beginning of time. The Bible says he makes all things beautiful in its time, not in our time, not according to our own arrangement. That is why we read from the first reading of today, taken from the book of Genesis chapter 2, where God established marriage, where God created marriage after he had created human beings. God himself said to us today, Oga Allahi, Kocho Milokoyo Anufofunu. And I turned to one of the priests with me on the altar, and I say, Akoda no wejiu kaaba. It is not good for a man to be alone, and yet you are alone. Are you disobeying God? No. The priesthood will not be here today to participate in this ceremony as witnesses on behalf of the church. So God saw by himself and decided it was not good for a man to be alone. I will make. And that is why nobody on earth will see marriage as his or her own creation. Nobody should see that this time is the right time for marriage or your time for marriage has passed. 
nobody should deceive you. Then God arranges a partner for you, a helpmate that will be suitable for you. It was God who said it's not good that a man should be alone. It was not Adam who said, God, I am tired of being alone. It was not Adam who said, God, see, all my friends and neighbors, my age mates have become married, they have families, they have children. No, it was God who said. You see, when you allow God to be the initiator of decisions concerning you, you are able to go back to him when things don't work to say, God, God, you only want my But when you push God to be something to decide on your own, it becomes difficult to go back to God when things don't work. I don't know if you that Frank I don't know if you about Frank, 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 and our, our sister, the Lord, we can walk, we can walk, we can walk, let me call the Lord, we can walk, we can walk, all these, the Lord, we can walk, 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 and I don't know what this issue of Frank, Frank, Frank and Anna. First of all, our father was Francis, our mother Francisca, our reverend father Francis, the husband now is Franklin. Whatever it is, I don't know. But God knows better for us and God knows why it has happened the way it is happening today. And I am sure that it was not Franklin that said, I am tired of living in the I want to go and get a wife. If you were the one that decided because others have gotten married, if the propelling factor of you entering this marriage is because your mates are married, you are going to fail. Or you know, if it is because young girls of your mates are getting married, that is why you are rushing into marriage. I am very sure. If you ask your elder brother for this I will tell you, I would prefer that you don't even get married yet. Left for him, you shouldn't be married by now. But when the time of God comes, and the God who has made his own arrangement, nobody can question the arrangement of God. Adam had been living in one of that nation. It could come with two young and young and young. Adam had been living in one of that nation. Adam had been living in one of that nation. Adam had been living in one of that nation. Adam had been living in one of that nation. Adam had been living in one of that nation. Adam had been living in one of that nation. Adam had been living in one of that nation. It is not good that a man should live alone and then go to the next step. The second step about the marriage is establishing marriage after the decision of not being for the man to be able to say, I will live for him. I will create for him. So if God does not create your partner for you and you are creating your own partner,
animals from the dust of the ground and brought the animals to the man to decide the name that he should give to them. The Bible says, whatever name he gave them, for the name they bore. So for you to go into marriage, any young man, any young woman who wants to go into marriage, sit down first and name your animals. If you don't know your you animal properly, you are going to settle with an animal deeply, you are settled, settling with a husband or a wife. The Bible says when Adam sat down, the tigers will come and the tigers will follow. And he will say, No, this is Mrs. Tiger. Therefore, she is tigress. He sees a lion, a female lion, and say, This is Mrs. Lion, therefore, she is lioness. He sees a watch, or I say, an air or a watch, like a dog, or you know. That was how he finished naming the animals one after the other. Having completed God's own assignment, the Bible says even among the animals, there was no help made suitable for him. Franklin and Oinone, if you have not finished your naming of animals, we can end the ceremony at this point so that you go back and name your animals. Nobody is rushing you into marriage. I am very sure. The family of France down there, if Oyelonye decides that I am going to marry the next three, four years, we would have been happier. So let it be known clearly that nobody is rushing out to say, you must get married. Go and get married. Your name, your mates are getting married. Nobody. That this girl, Oyelonye, Veronica, Rita, Ahmed, is the first girl you ever saw and loved all your life. And God decided instantly. You are going to marry her, I will tell you you are lying. And therefore you are not ready for marriage yet. You must have named animals. There were those that related with you very properly, you were related very closely, you did so many things with them, but along the line you discover that they had some animalistic tendencies in one way or the other, and you allow them to go. Some were egos, some were robots, some were other times before you came to meet and say, at last. Until you get to the state of that at last, marriage cannot take place. This is the bone for my bone and the flesh for my flesh. The same thing I want to say before my younger sister, my own daughter told, that if you are telling us that Franklin is the first man that ever approached you, and I say, I want, he wants it, I want to marry you, and you accepted immediately, and marriage is beginning now, I am going to stand on this altar and say, you are not ready for marriage yet. Let us cancel the marriage first, until you finish naming your animals. See? Somebody could be a helpmate, suitable for one person, but to be an animal for another person. The person that God has given to you. That's why they say, this man is very bad. This man is very wicked. This man is very stingy. This man is very this. The same man comes into the life of another woman and he becomes milky, milky, sugar, sugar, and becomes everything. Because in the life of another person, he was supposed to be an animal and not a helpmate. I'm not a husband right there. So frankly, what God is giving to you today in this young girl is a helpmate, not a servant. What is giving to you today is a helpmate, not a slave. Who will be useful to you and who will help you when you cannot do it by yourself? Then you say in our culture, oh yeah, I am not going to be who are evil people. The woman should not. The woman would not, the woman could not, the woman did not, the woman has not. If that is what you are formed to do, I want to let you that the days of slavery have ended. If you are not going to get a helpmate that will be suitable to you, but you are going to get a slave that will be subjected to you, then you are formed for the wrong person. Then the man that you are going to enter will be guided by the principles of the altar of Christ not guided by the culture of the evil people, not guided by the culture of the normal people. This is a transcultural or a miscultural marriage, and for that reason, only Christ should be at the center of every decision in marriage. From now, until the next 25 years, I know that 25 years have seen their life, we not just talk about this again, but our life. That passes. First of all, she go and you are having honeymoon and sugar moon. That will be looking at this moon, this honeymoon. As you are having your honeymoon and everything, one of the things you are going to do about the number one is that you are going to open a new account. A new account. Father is one of the 
commanding that one from this project. No matter how difficult things become every month, I call it marriage retirement account. Every month, drop something into the account. No matter how hungry you are, decide as you go for your honeymoon. Don't go and decide we are going to put 100,000 every month. We are going to put 500. No, no, no. I am talking of 2,000 naira, 5,000 naira. From this side, from this side, you put in that marriage retirement account. When in 25 years from now, and your first child will be like 24 years already, that is when you are going to break the account and check what you have in the account. Anywhere I am, tell me how much you have in that account. You would have come to discover a great magic that you have sent something tangible that when you are no longer strong to work again, you are still able to take care of your children from that marriage retirement account. As you go, I pray that God will be with you. I pray that God will bless you. I pray that you will succeed in this marriage. I pray that two women, the normal people and the evil people, do Christ our Lord.
I promise to be true to you. In good time and in bad. In sickness and in health, I will love you and honor you. All the best.
Give me show how you honor and cherish her always to the love that Christ has for his church. And now, Lord, we employ you. May these your servants hold fast to the faith and keep your commandments. Meanwhile, in the flesh, may there be blameless in all they do. And with the strength that comes from the gospel, may there be a true witness to Christ before all. May they be blessed with children and prove themselves precious parents who live to see their children's children. And grant that, reaching at last without the fullness of years for which they hope, they may come to the life of the blessed, to the kingdom of heaven. Through Christ.
why they can't do before with you. May God eternal Father keep you of one heart in love for one another, that the peace of Christ may dwell in you and abide always in your home. Amen. Amen. May you be blessed in your children and your soldiers in your friends and enjoy true peace with everyone. Amen. Amen. May you be witnesses in the world to God's charity so that the afflicted and needy who have known your kindness may one day receive your kindness of thankfully. Receive you thankfully into the eternal dwelling of God. Amen. Amen. And may your mercy God bless you. The Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go forth, the mass is ended.
destruction can never stand. Praise the Lord. Shall we bow on our head as we will be going to the Lord in prayer this hour? Father, we want to say thank you for your goodness. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your loving kindness. Thank you for the preservation of lives and destinies. Thank you, Father, for people that you brought from a far off Imo state to this particular environment. Thank you for those who came all the way from Lagos. Thank you for those of us that came all the way from Abuja city. Father, this hour we want to recognize your presence in our midst. I want to say thank you, Father, for how you have led and taken us thus far. We want to commit this, oh God, marriage between Mr. Francis and Veronica, I mean Fra Franklin and Veronica, this evening into your able hands. Father, I want to say nothing shall by any means afflict this marriage in the name of Jesus. Bible speaking, there are many devices in the heart of man, but only the counsel of the Lord shall stand. I stand in the authority of the word of God to decree and to declare over this marriage that it is only the word of God and the counsel of the Almighty that shall stand for this marriage in the mighty name of Jesus. The Bible says many shall gather, but because the gathering is not of the Lord, that gathering shall be scattered in the mighty name of Jesus. Anywhere the wicked one, the witches, the wizard, the occultic, the demonic one shall assemble themselves together as a reason for this union, for this marriage. I decree that they shall all scattered in the mighty name of Jesus. I heard from the Reverend Father that preached to us in the church that there was a time he was occasioning a marriage like this and somebody came while the bride was dancing. The chief bride made when that spread a charm on the seat of that uh, bride and he asked the person, go and remove it and the person said, I cannot remove it. Father, I take authority in the name that is above every other name. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Any man that shall be here, any woman that is here, any boy that is here, any girl that is here, with any full imagination, any charm in his pocket, in the past, anywhere, to attack nor afflict anybody, I destroy that charm in the name of Jesus. To Imo State, as we return to Lagos, as we return to FCT, as we all return to our various own, even within the community here, yeah, nobody shall die. Amen. There shall be no barrier as a result of this wedding. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. I frustrate every demonic, satanic, evil heart that are here tonight. In the name of Jesus, Amen. we are here to celebrate and we are here to rejoice with Franklin and the wife. I decree and I declare this meeting open tonight in the name of God the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. I come against every agenda to give us a very beautiful sound. Where is my MC? Please come and take off.
Gabriel, vamos lá puxar pra você. All the way back from Imo State, we they come Benue State now. Yeah, we they come from Benue State. Obadibo, local government area of Benue State. We are from Obadibo. We they come from Uba. We are from Uba. We they come from Adu Uba. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. Everybody minor! Everybody minor! Uh -huh. No, we don't come in my land. We will work on. This person I want to introduce now. We have not been here before. But what he gets? This person is 10 in 1. This person we have to introduce you. Now, man of substance. Man where they make water, they flow. The man where they say if he declare and decree anything impossible, they become possible. The man where they say was he consult the Almighty Father. Mm -hmm. That thing where they say mm -hmm, he go to. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let us make welcome our 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 one and only man of God, our daddy in the law, our father in the house. Mr. Innocent to the high table. A round of applause. A round of applause. A round of applause. You support better, better music.
First, please bear with us and I want to assure you that as we are going back rejoicing and as we have rejoiced with them joy and celebration will never depart from your own home in this season in the name of Jesus hallelujah I want to formally declare this meeting open and just a brief prayer for that. Father, I want to say thank you because we have seen that your hand is already on this occasion, on this union. And we pray that as many who desire such, O oh God, that are here tonight, uh, such will be granted to that individual in Jesus' name. And we pray that as we move forward, your mighty hands will rest upon the couple and upon every one of us tonight in Jesus' name. Allah go and you wow. The Lord bless us in Jesus. That we have our groom in the house. Please, ladies and gentlemen, with a round of applause, if you know they clap, you may wish. Look at me, but what they clap? Look at me, look at me. If you know they clap, you may wish. With a round of applause. So, DJ, give up better music. All right.
May I know your names? My names are Franklin Chinagomi. Nice to see you. Today remarks one of the days you really expected in your life. What do you really call today? Well, uh, today is the most uh, wonderful day in my life. Uh, I think I'm, I'm, the, I'm the happiest person to find this beautiful bride called uh, Veronica. Uh, you know, in a lovely family like this. Um, I'm happy and I'm grateful. And I'm grateful for the weather. I'm grateful for how the thing is going. And uh, I thank God for everything. Thank you very much. Can you just remind us the first day you met this uh, girl? <laughs> well, um, the very first day I met her was magical. Um, it was like a, like a dream. Um, in fact, when we met, um, the connection, the bond, showcased immediately. You understand? So from that moment, I knew she's my wife. To that moment, I knew that this lady is my wife. The connection, the bonding, and everything um, was very um, mutual and was very, was very. Um, I can, I can just say one thing. I captured something from you. You say from the dreams. I mean, the dreams have just come to pass today. What can you tell the Almighty God who made today another joyous day again? Well, uh, um, I thank God for, make, especially today. You know, it's not a, a, an easy journey. All the way from him, we stay down here. Um, journey that was started on Friday. And uh, thanking God for Johnny Messi, thanking God for the weather of today, and uh, having made everything possible. You know, from the white wedding here, we are at the traditional uh, marriage venue. I really thank God and bless God for Thank you very much, brother. I know friends are where we shall are here today to honor this uh, wedding ceremony invitation. What sort of advice do you have for them? I like to thank especially my friends and where we shall Especially those that came all the way from Abba, Ubu and Uliabia. You know, to come and greet the occasion. It's not easy to come all the way from that distance. And I, I want to thank them. And I want, I'm very grateful. You know, and I believe for them to have come here, I'm, I and my family are very special to them. And I'm, I really, um, I'm really, really grateful. Thank you very much. The Bible tells us at uh, the book of the, uh, the three tavas. That tells us that uh, to whom much is given, much is expected. I mean, the one giving one shilling and the one two shilling and ten shilling, uh, you see, they are being expected to bring returns as their uh, 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 value of uh, money is being given. Today, I must say to whom much is given, much is expected also. I think much has been given to you, and in returns, much is expected from you back. What can you say about this? What can you say about this? Okay, uh, I believe by the grace of Almighty God, much has been given to me, and uh, much is being expected from me. And uh, by the grace, special grace of God, not by my power, I work at time to, to actualize that. I said to God be that glory. May you remain blessed. Remain blessed. <laughs> but I see something from inside the same Bible. Okay. Uh, <laughs> now if, now I give Adam, up to eat to. Not true. Have you not been so? Not true. Who they deceive? Na ma. Who be if? Na woman. Who be if? Na woman. Who lie to Adam to eat the fruit? Na woman. When they want punish the people, who them punish? Na Adam. Adam. Adam na woman. Na woman be na man. Na man. The thing where woman they do us. If I talk and hear, Franklin go fear. Hey. All the things where woman do for Bible, God forgive them. Amen. But if woman do one thing, God will flog her. Not true. Now if lie, now God, Adam, pun Adam punish, uh, God punish Adam. Yes. A lie? You know Not true. Lie. Woman a lie? <laughs> they know they talk again. <laughs>
Somebody they laugh. But these things do happen. It they happen. Not the only for where cuts before she go come outside. The groom go sew the slippers with the sum of three thousand naira. Better clap, better clap, better clap. Our groom is capable. Oh no, my person will go show the slippers. Send the person where go saw the slippers come so that I go saw the slippers when she come at quick. All right, all right. Now, our high table members, our people from here, from here, we go try see how we will test saw the slippers so that our very own or human near go come at and be with her husband. Respectfully. Agreed. Hey, be like say people don't. Listen. One. Of who again and can go make a guagaba. You must do it. Your wife's sleep has all caught for road. Now we need to sew them. They say with He said oh very fire. Everything. Shake a balance. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Man. You cannot verify here. Yeah. <laughs> this is not Lagos. Only oh, rich Lagos to verify. <laughs> you have to now sow your wife's papers to the sum with the sum of ten thousand naira. The money is to be given to this aboki cash. Are you aboki? They are come closer. Are you aboki? He said, "Man, you guys, I'm everybody the same. Man, I want show. Nothing to go. Man, gonna shine on the eye. Where, where? Man, gonna shine on the eye. Where?" Let me show you how Ten thousand naira. Ten thousand naira. Yeah. Okay. So we need to.
here beside the beautiful bride and groom in time i'm going to be talking about the cake itself what the cake stands for the word uh, cake c-a-k-e they see the cake stands for care 
The A stands for attention. The K stands for knowledge. Y the E stands for endurance. So we are going straight forward to cut the cake. We will need some people to come and witness the cutting of the cake. MC. Mr. Franklin, please hold your wife. Eh? Put any power on it. It starts with what is E? Maybe not give me E. Now, Jesus Christ came to die for us and save us from sin. He saved us what is from sin. So that makes it our Lord, our Lord, Messiah, and Savior. So Lord Jesus Christ is our Savior. If you want to agree, give me S. Yes. Now, who Jesus Christ God died for? Now all of us. And us start with what? You, you and me. Give me you. you. Now, Jesus Christ gave us one important gift. What did he give us? Salvation. That salvation starts with what? S. So give me S. Yes. Now, let's go. J. J. E. 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 S. S. U. Understanding husband. Oh, yeah, they talk. All right. <laughs> Our bride won't feed her husband. Our unhuman near. You want to feed her husband. Okay, All right. So now they wash. They're going to wash her. Chest of peace, joy, love, and prosperity. Chest of long life in Jesus' name. Hip 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 hip
everybody, thank everybody for coming. We can save Johnny going home. On behalf of myself and my beautiful wife and the entire family of um, Isim and Indi Uyada Ugwagaban here, I want to especially thank every one of you that grace this occasion. Your coming here is a sign of love for us and um, we pray that your mighty God grant you all of you joy mercy to your respective uh, place. I also thank my in-laws for your, your hospitality and your welcome. We thank you for all, all you have done. You will try this the traditional rest. I want to thank you in a special way. I say may the Lord bless you and that's the Lord Jesus. Welcome. Thank you very much. Welcome. A round of applause for our beautiful, handsome groom. A round of applause, you just want to. Thank you very much. 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 Amen. My beloved sister. Happy to see you. Thank you, sir. It's time for the presentation of the gift. And the family of the bride want to present it. What is it? God really did see it in a miraculous way for me, and I really appreciate God for that. I know friends and well wishers are here to honor this wedding ceremony invitations. What sort of advice do you have for them? Well, as for my friends, I pray that. As they honor me, they celebrated me, I pray that God will celebrate them and they will also find their right partner. All of them are single, but going back, in fact, from next month, I'll be going for their own wedding. God will make it. Thank you very much. I said to God be the glory. Remember. The family of the bride, the family of the bride has come with a beautiful, big, large, and um, very conspicuous gift for the beautiful couple. All right, DJ Swanky, play something nice. Play something nice for them. Presentation of gift, presentation of gift. I can see the family handing over the gift to the beautiful couple. Mr. and Mrs. Franklin and Sirim. What a wonderful gift. Yeah. Nigeria 